thank you to HelloFresh for sponsoring today's video. Are you ready to go? Yep. Oh my god, it's stuff sticky. What is this, honey? You look like a lobster. What? <laughs> bam, bam, what's going on? Welcome back. If you're new here, welcome back to Football of Fatherhood. You know what I'm saying? And today, we got something fun. We got something special. Me and Maddie about to get all beautified <laughs> you know what i'm saying so today me and maddie are gonna have a spa day and i gotta get everything ready but before we have our spa day i want to share something with y'all that has truly been a blessing for my life and for my family and that's hello fresh they deliver recipes with fresh fresh ingredients and i've really just been enjoying cooking with these meal kits and i want to show y'all how it works so i'm gonna cook one of the meals that i got this week tonight for maddie and for the girls but yesterday i cooked up something special. So the three meals that I got this week are the apricot miso chicken, the silky Sicilian penne, and the chicken and guac burrito bowl. So they send you the box and in the box there's some recipe cards that come with the meals. And they're super, super easy to follow. Most meals only take like 20 to 30 minutes, which I can really appreciate because washing dishes and cleaning up isn't the funnest part of cooking. I'll just say that. HelloFresh gives me step-by-step -step instructions. Like there's pre-measured ingredients, you know what I'm saying? Like all I gotta do is show up. Just show up and just put everything in there and whip it up. You can legit feel how fresh the ingredients are when you cut into them. You just you just feel the freshness, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and also when I'm cutting all this stuff up, I'm just thinking like, how much will all this stuff cost at the grocery store? You know what I'm saying? When it's all said and done, it's like 40% cheaper than going to the grocery store. So it's good for my body and it's good for my budget. And the menu changes every week, so it's super easy to find different meals for my family. So them changing the meal makes things even easier. To be honest, I wish I knew about HelloFresh sooner. You know what I'm saying? I'm saving money, I'm eating fresh food, I ain't gotta go out to the grocery store, you know what I'm saying? It's just a game changer for me. But I'm glad I know about it now, you know what I'm saying? Because now I can save that money, eat good food, spend more time with my family, and it's a win for everybody. So shout out to HelloFresh again for sponsoring today's video and for the meals. They are the bomb.com. So make sure you go to HelloFresh.com and use my code SETBYME10 to get 10 free meals, including free shipping. But now, it's time to get into the spa day. Are you excited to have a spa day? You want to run, don't you? I love Can you come talk to dad? I'm going to jump first. Okay. Good job. Hey. Are you ready for a spa day? Yep. You know what a spa day is? It's when we take care of ourselves, our skin. We're going to do our nails. Do our nails? Do our nails. You want to do daddy's nails? Yeah. I, I can do your toes. You can't? Do you think daddy's toes are icky? What the heck is on my toes? <laughs> You want to do daddy's toes? Yeah. Okay, we gotta get ready for our, get our stuff ready, okay? Alright, we gotta cut some cucumbers. Is it a vegetable? It is a vegetable. Good job. Yeah. This is a curl from that. Daddy, you get a grown up hand, okay? All right, fam, bam, so we got our cucumbers all cut up. You know what I'm saying? For the eyes, you know what I'm saying? I honestly don't even know why you put cucumbers on your eyes, if I'm being honest with you. Five cookies for Auntie Maddie's birthday. That's so right. Yo, Maddie is getting like super smart, dog. I can't even believe she remembered that. So we used this same cutting board to make um, some butterfly cookies for Charlotte's sister who passed away. Her name's Maddie. We named my daughter after Maddie. There's like, I'll put a link to the video up here, but we did make butterfly cookies for her Auntie Maddie who's in heaven. That's crazy that she remembers that, dog. My baby's getting so grown. But yeah, we got our cucumbers all cut up. So the first thing we wanna do is get our faces right. Charlotte got us some cream and stuff from Target. So Charlotte's not here right now. She went to go drop Luke off so me and Maddie can have our day of our spa day. Um, but yeah, we're gonna do everything in the living room. Let's go get your princess mirror and daddy's gonna get his his king mirror, okay? Is it my pink one? Yeah, it is your pink one. Should we go get it? Is it princesses? Mm -hmm. It's this one up here. Wow, it's a princess mirror. I low key set myself up saying it's a princess mirror because there's no princesses on it. But you know what I'm saying? I called an audible. I shifted. You know what I'm saying? Because I found Maddie's troll. Uh, she has a big troll sticker book and there's a princess in it Princess Poppy. You guys all know about Princess Poppy. I'll link that video if you know what I'm talking about, if you're an OG. And then I'm gonna get my king mirror because she a princess. I'm the king. You know what I'm saying? You know how we get down. I'm doing the whole mirror. Let's put some princess poppy stickers, okay? That's a bad guy, though. You want to put the bad guy in your mirror? You do? Okay. To be some friends. Mm-hmm. Good job, honey. Good job. And daddy's gonna go get his mirror, okay? You can keep okay. putting stickers, okay? okay? 
All right, so technically, uh, this is not my mirror. This is Charlotte's mirror. And Charlotte has had this mirror ever since I knew her in college. This is the king mirror. Yeah, I don't want to talk about why it's so dirty, you know what I'm saying? But whatever, this is my mirror that we're going to put in there. I'm going to get some Windex and uh, clean it off. Don't judge me. Actually, you can't judge me. Judge Charlotte. This is her mirror, but it's my king mirror for the day. Maddie, daddy got his mirror. This is the vibe over here, you know what I'm saying? This is my office. And you know, I feel like a spa has some greenery, you know what I'm saying? Want to show the fan bam? Okay. What do you want to show them how beautiful your thing is? Should we put it up here? Yeah. So the only thing is, this thing is a little bit tall, but Maddie has a step stool in the bathroom that she can use so she can beautify herself and then I can just be on my knees next to her and doing our thing, you know what I'm saying? Well, that's, that's a good job, baby, good job. Your mirror's dirty too, should we clean it? Yep, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna get the weight. First, Daddy has to move his guitar speaker, okay? I don't need one of the soaps. It's not going away. It's because it's, it's a scratch. It's okay though. Our daddy's gonna get the cucumbers, okay? I'll be right back. I'm gonna get go get it. How did it take me down? All right, fam bam. So we got our face mask, cucumber station all set up. You know what I'm saying? Now the next thing we gotta do is get the nail stuff ready. And yes, Maddie's gonna do my nails. You know what I'm saying? And I'm okay with that. Girl dad, you know what I'm saying? Matter of fact, I ain't even got my shirt on. Hold on. My bad, dog. I had to put it on, had to represent. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what was wrong with me. Ain't that right, baby? <laughs> gotta represent for all the girl dads out there. So now we gotta get our nail station set up. I'm gonna put that on our radiator area because that way we can go from face mask spot to the nail spot and then we go into the spa spot with the bath and stuff. <laughs> So I talked to Charlotte and apparently I was wrong. So you don't do nails and face first. You do like the bath first and then you do all the beautified stuff after. So I'm about to get Maddie a bath running and then she has a surprise for herself that she's gonna put in there. I actually don't really like these things because it makes it a mess, but we'll just keep that between a us two. <laughs> See, Maddie knows what it is. It's a bath bomb. So we got bath first, face second, nails last, and it's time to get beautified. Do you want to go see your surprise? Daddy put it in the living room. <laughs> what do you think of it? What is this? It's called a robe. Robe? A robe, yeah. And these are my gloves? Uh, they're not gloves, <laughs> they're for your eyes. We gotta use this for your hair, okay, so we can put it up in a bun when we do our faces, okay? You like these slippers? Are they are for me too? They are for you, you wanna try them on? This on, mm -hmm. then you put this on, you tie it. <laughs> Do you like it? Yeah. Yeah, it's so comfy. Take it off. What? Well, you want to take it off? Look, there's even a hood on it. You don't like it? No. Why? You want to take it off for real? Yeah. Spent money on that. Now that's over with. Do you like the slippers at least? <laughs> you don't like the slippers? Are you serious? All right, look, she's being a pain in She don't want to put her robe on. She don't want her hair up. I don't want it up. <laughs> she, yo, I... <laughs> this is Charlotte's robe. <laughs> My bad, I'll be right back. So, she don't want to put her robe on. She put her old clothes back on after she just got, just got out the tub. But I'm not gonna let her kill my vibe. We having a spa day today. And I'm looking, I, I want to get beautiful. I don't know about you, little girl, but I'm getting beautiful. I'm, I'm good. I'm gonna do a face mask now. No. Why? Because I don't want to. You don't want to? No. No? All right, fam, fam, I have no idea why she isn't feeling it. She mentioned that she was scared to do it for some reason, and this is the first time she's done something like this, so I'm sure, like, any first experience for a kid is scary, so hopefully I can do it, and then maybe she wants to tag along once she sees that it's safe, but you never know with three-year-olds, you know what I'm saying, so. Come here, why are you running away? Oh, God. God, this stuff is sticky. Is it supposed to be this slimy? Here. <laughs> <laughs> I see why she didn't want to do it. You look like a monster. 
What? <laughs> All right, fam, fam, I don't know about y'all, but I don't think I look like a monster. You know what I'm saying? I think I look good. You know what I'm saying? Why do I look like a monster? You put on the face mask. All right, so you don't want to do a face mask? No. What do you want to do? I want to do my nails. Okay, stay down. Pick the color, and I'll be right back. Get him on the carpet. It's okay. Let me clean it up. Mm -hmm. Gotta do my toes over here. You want daddy to help? Made it so good. We had a little little oopsie right here, huh? Yeah. But it's okay. We'll get better, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Do you have a good spa day? Yeah. Yeah. I, I want to put my hair down. You like take your this. hair down now. You're over it. No, I'm gonna keep it like this. You're gonna keep it like that now? Yeah. Now I'm gonna watch the iPad. You're gonna watch the iPad? Okay. Fan bam, what's going on? Your boy actually got some real self care today after me and Maddie's uh. You know, <laughs> after our spa day, I had a haircut and I'm feeling good. You know what I'm saying? I scrubbed my face all up. So your face, my face, your face, <laughs> my face is feeling uh, fresh. And obviously you can tell I'm tired. But yeah, today was fun. Um, Maddie really enjoyed the spa day. I noticed when I was getting a haircut, some of the stuff we didn't even do. Like I cut up those cucumbers. We didn't even use them because Maddie wasn't feeling the mask. And I completely forgot. You know what I'm saying? Maddie didn't get to paint my feet. Thank God, you know what I'm saying? I'm some dogs, you know what I'm saying? Football jacked up my feet. Um, but other than that, it was like really, really good. Um, I really enjoyed doing stuff like that with Maddie uh, for myself as her dad a lot because more than anything, I think I learned patience and I learned understanding and, I'll, and I'm always reminded like, hey, like she's only three, you know what I mean? And what I mean by that, I think as parents, like we have all these expectations or these plans or things that we want to do with our kids. And sometimes they just not with it. You know what I'm saying? Like even like when we were doing, um, when we were shooting, there are times we had to sit and talk to Maddie to try to get her to calm down because, you know, I'm trying to capture an experience with her because I know she'll really appreciate this when she's older. Um, and I would love to watch this, you know, when I'm 60 and she's 20 or whatever, you know what I mean? It's just super cool for me. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, I'm, it really teaches me patience to not really stoop down to her level when she's that way, like when she's crying or don't want to cooperate because I think it's really easy to get that way. When we have these high expectations for our kids and they don't go how we how we plan because of them, I think it's easy to put the like they're ungrateful or they don't understand all that I'm doing, um, they don't care, when in reality they're just kids, you know what I mean? And I think a lot of the times what I like to do is be like, okay, I tell myself, Maddie's three years old. She doesn't really know all the work that really goes into this. She doesn't really understand how it took me time to set up the nail polish and set up all this stuff and clean her mirror and cut the cucumbers and buy the cucumbers and all this stuff. She'll never understand it. And I think when she's older, maybe one day she will. And I think maybe she'll look at me as a dad who she realized, um, you know, I'm doing everything that I can for her to have these really cool experiences and let her know that I love her. Um, and for me, this was cool because self-care is something that I do myself. You guys know that I meditate and I try to do things, to take care of my body by eating, eating well. Um, and self-care is important. I think implementing that to my kids early to teach them that will hopefully be good for them in the long run. You know what I mean? So 
yeah, overall today was a really good day. And I went to the barber shop like this. And I have no shame, you know what I'm saying? They was clowning, you know what I'm saying? But whatever, you know what I'm saying? Guess what? I'm a girl dad and I'm proud. And guess what? This washes off. Who cares? You know what I'm saying? That memory that Maddie has will stay in there forever. And if it doesn't stay there, I've recorded it. <laughs> so like a reminder, your daddy painted nails on TV or YouTube rather. YouTube is kind of like TV. There is YouTube TV. But yeah, I'm tired y'all. I'm about to go to bed and uh, appreciate y'all for watching. Uh, again, thank you to HelloFresh for sponsoring today's video. The food is the bomb.com, like I said. And we will see you guys on the next one. So, till next time.